Salutations, this is Grim Devel. Welcome back to our Let's Play of Tavern Tycoon. I think this might be our last episode on Stage 8, Graveyard Happy Hour. Oh, we got an inspection result. 1.9! Pretty okay. Uh, we're just going to keep things on fast speed here and watch the money roll on in. And I think we'll be able to get to level 9 this episode. I think we might even be able to spend a little bit of time, hopefully, in whatever stage 9 is going to be. If I'm disciplined enough to just keep it rolling on fast speed. Uh, I don't think we really have any big problems here. I'll keep an eye out for things that need to be repaired. But I think... Ah, you don't like the food prices. But if only some people are complaining about that and they're still paying it anyway, I think I'd rather keep it that expensive. Our food is... All of our food is level 3. Good day. Tavern's going well. Come on by. Cool. 11,000. Anything else? Yeah, people generally are not up, are not unhappy with the price of, of the food. The express shop you waited for too long. Uh, I guess I could have expanded this. I don't think there's... It's possible I could rearrange this room to make it a little better. Huh. Could try it. Everyone out. Let's see if we can't rearrange this to add a third table uh, using just the space that we have. Good. Let's relocate all furniture. So this one... Up there. Um, every, slow down. Slow down. Just, I can't even pause it right now. Yeah, that can go there. Uh, this can go there. Excellent! Can we fit any poster stands? Uh, no. So this is a little problematic. I can't fit any poster stands. Um... Okay. What do they even do? Edit mode. Uh. I mean, it's possible that now that I moved that, I can put in a poster stand somewhere? Possibly? But no. Ah, frustrating. Um, of course, people are complaining now. Uh. Um, yeah, I don't think there's anything I can do, unfortunately. Uh, what if I moved... Ugh, didn't really mean that. Put you there. Put you there. It's kind of the same as before. Yeah. Not much I can do about it. All right. It is what it is. It was no improvement. It was an experiment. Worth experimenting. And we got to spend some time doing that. We will accept all of these. Mass accept. Month of report. Oh, I guess I missed a couple of months, but that's fine. It's actually probably good. Inspection results are one. I don't know what General Dion saw, but it wasn't good. Anything we need to replace? Tables? Any tables? Yeah, we'll replace... Oh! Was that a year past? Great, we're doing excellent. And we are the richest tavern at 72,000. Very nice. We have the mo uh, second most guests. And our salary is not that bad. Even though we always accept, always say give people raises. Oh, you can be replaced. 
And you can be replaced. And you can be replaced. You're fine. You can be replaced. You can be replaced. All right, replacing a bunch of furniture. Piano's doing just dandy. Um, replace you, even though you have a guest at you. And you too. You waited the express, yeah, a lot of people waited for the express shop too long. Sorry about that, everybody. Okay. Pay raise. Give it. Oh, the other thing I haven't been doing is uh, training people. People have not been trained for quite a while. And we have idlers. These maidens are idle. Let's give them tip master for sure. And then this handy person. How about um, fast? Be fast. Okay. 100,000. Here we come. Yeah, all these people leave with negative reputations, probably all from the waiting for the express shop too long. And that is definitely my bad. It's because I had things at fast speed while I was editing it and playing around. It's okay. We're all doing over here. Okay. Coming in here. Now, what's at the express shop? I mean, not express shop, gambling den, which is interesting. Maybe there was a shift change or something? Yeah. Earthquakes. Earthquakes are trouble. It only ever seems to affect... No, it did affect some stuff over here. But most of this stuff is new. Uh, I heard a rat. I thought I did. It's probably already gone. Uh, reception desk is fine. We got some ding-dongs to accept. Uh, good. Accept them all. All right, we're at 76,000. Just keep pushing forward here. Oh, yeah, let's replace this bar. Um, yep, there you go. <laughs> I don't really care that people were sitting there and using it actively. Great. Come on in. Enjoy our lovely ambiance. Okie doke, anything else? I don't know, still got some stuff being repaired. Ooh, yeah, definitely need a new bookshelf there, very much. Yeah. Uh, with 1.1, you can definitely tell that the performance on high speed is a lot better. I, I, do def I definitely have to give that to the devs. The performance improvements with 1.1 have definitely gone a long way, ooh. Good income there. We want more. More people. <laughs> what am I supposed to do about this interior? Um, I guess have more um, cleaning people, handy people. I could hire another one. Um, sure. And it looks like we have room enough. Your idling. Get a uh, nibble feet. Locals are all welcome. Come in, all ye zombies. All ye weary. Brain hungry souls. Anything else I can do here before we leave this level? I feel like there's usually e little, little visual Easter eggs every level. And oh, we did it! I got an achievement graveyard happy hour. And we have a new management position. Let us accept. I knew we could do it. <laughs> yes. Excellent. All right, stage nine. Nothing is on special. I'm excited. Who knows? What lies in store for us? I mean, it seems like the further we get, the more we just kind of have to approach everything the same way. At first, very carefully. 
uh, build things as we need them. Um, while you were on your way to the capital, Lord Peter has summoned you to this tavern again. The tavern has gone into a disarray after you left. Do what you have to do to get the tavern working. Reach 2,000 reputation, 125,000 tavern value, and keep your finances above 80,000. These goals are lower than they have been. You will be fired if the tavern goes under. Okay, so this is our first tavern? Uh, I mean, this is not... I would not have... All right, hold on. Let's um, put a clock in. I don't remember... Our first tavern did not look like this. Um, I mean, it might have been the same layout, for sure. But we... this I don't think it, like, loaded in our first tavern, because I would not put a bar like this. This is weird. Um, no, we want to name it. Also, what happened to the name? This should still be Grimm's Grogatorium. Just because we left doesn't mean this is a franchise. Good. Set the name. All right. So it's nice that there's stuff already put down. But I think we're going to want to relocate things. We're going to want to change everything. This is really stupid to have this here. I'm just going to demolish this gymnasium. This is a bad place for a gymnasium. Um, actually, before I do that, any new furniture? Any new zones? No. But last time we had this layout, we were not able to put all the zones down. So there is that. All right. Uh, demolisher. Good. Get a little money back. Okay, and I kind of don't remember. I do not remember this layout at all. I feel like, unless they changed it in 1.1, like what the layout of the first level would be. And these, I don't know, these guest rooms really make sense to stay here. The kitchen could still be right there, maybe. But it's poorly sized. I'm kind of thinking we just destroy all these rooms. Get a little money back. All the furniture we will keep. Um, yeah, even the restroom I'm going to move. And that's all we have. The furniture we can move. We don't need to demolish it. Just kind of move it to the side for now. This is interesting that we're able to do this. That they give us some stuff to start with. It's cool. I mean, I guess that makes up for starting with low money. All right. The bar. What are we going to do? Uh, yeah, we could put two bars on the sides here. Let's get a kitchen. I think it makes sense for the kitchen to be here. Oh, I think the bar can't go be there. I think uh, it needs to move over a little bit right to there. And now can we put a kitchen in there? Should be able to. Six by four is fine. Um, You know what? This area makes a lot more sense for a kitchen, doesn't it? Um, actually, I want it right where all this furniture is. Sorry, it's a little annoying. I know I moved all the furniture there to begin with. And I'll try to move some of these benches where maybe we'll leave them. Okay. Kitchen. I think back here. Good. Good. 
great. And we do need restrooms. Five by four. We could put these over here. I think that makes sense. Um, how much space is here? Ten. Uh, leaving four by four, I think that's good. Six by four is good. Ah, no, misclicked. And move that piece of furniture. Cool. Okay. And we will need a research room. Like let let's now like think rethink now that we've kind of moved everything out of the way and gotten some basics down, let's make sure that we can research. That is still super important. We don't have a lot of room uh, at first, and I don't know how much these cost. Let's see how much these things cost. Four to five hundred, forty eight fifty, and forty five hundred. Okay. I think we can afford one of these rooms. And this one I think is biggest, 12 by 10. That one's bigger. 4,500. I, I like this one. Okay. Let's get a research workshop in the back. It does need to be, oof. It's not a good use of space. If we have a six by six workshop in here, not at all. What if we put it here? Is that a better use of space? Maybe. I don't really want to put it in here. I don't even know if it would fit in there. Yeah, I think this is an okay use of space. Back there, it just would not be. Uh, yeah. Okay. And ovens. Oh, another oven. I forgot to hit shift. Cool. Very good. Let's make sure we get... Ooh, we have a lot of maidens to choose from here. Uh... We're looking for research focus at first, and no one has it. So we'll just, uh, here, tip master. I might switch you out later. And yeah. Time to talk. I'm busy here. We need three bartenders. Okay, we have three with powers. <laughs> powers. Um, to everyone but you. Hello. Sorry, can't talk right now. And let's manage them. Only research for now. And only research for now. Good. We will need a staff break room. Where is it? Staff room. Five by four. Um, Maybe back here. We could put it over here. But... I feel like we might be able to use that space better. We're gonna need like a storage room. Five by four. Um, we could go th here. Yeah. And Fine. Lock. Oh, um, right. There, we do need to put in a carpet. I feel like. Let's. Oh, I didn't. I didn't really mean that. Locate. Relocate the door. There. I think that might be better for the locker placement. Carpet there. 
blocker. Ah. Uh, um, can I put the door here? I can't. Okay, and that will allow me to put in one more locker. Okay. Good. And I think a storage room is vital. Six by four. Do I put that in here? I think so. Uh, oh, there's a uh, bench there. But it will fit. Good. Okay. Uh, I think we do need to move this door as well to add one more storage shelf. And also, that's better. Okay. We don't have a whole lot of money. Uh, we will move these closer to the kitchen. Good, and I guess we'll start things up. Let's hire a handyman. The best one we can find. Not a lot of skills with the handyman. So I guess someone with, ooh, you have a lot of potential, but, okay, you have potential and you're nimble, so there you go. Uh, let's go into the research screen, make sure that at first we just go totally for new recipes and use these research potions because we have dedicated research people off the bat. I will move this clock so we can put something else there. Okay. And I guess we can open and we can see what people want. And with that, I think we're going to put in a cut. Um, not unhappy with how this is starting. We're going to need to be very careful and hopefully we won't need to restart this ever. I enjoyed playing with you today and I'll see you next time. Bye everybody.